retain its leave their hearts in San Francisco, but San Francisco has left a tram car in Sydney. Sydney's sister city handed over the vintage tram today, much to the delight of local rail enthusiasts. This 1948 double-ended tram is one of only ten ever made. Tourism Minister Senator Graham Richardson accepted it from the US Consul General at Sydney's Loftus Tram Museum. After the presentation, all aboard for the first ride. The tram is pretty zippy for an old-timer, capable of speeds of 80 kilometres an hour. Not to be confused with the famous cable cars that climb San Francisco's hills, this electric tram saw active duty in other parts of the city right up until the early 1980s. And the number one fan of the San Fran tram is the museum's founder, Norm Chin. Well, this car is very important because it is the missing link, if I may say, in the technology between the final trams designed and operated in Sydney and the current ones that Melbourne are putting on the road today. The last tram stopped operating in Sydney back in 1961, and many enthusiasts are still lamenting their demise. But here at the Loftus Museum, it's still possible to take a trip back into the past. Tony Biancotti, 10 News.